Michelle Pierre remembers when she was a child and loving all things creative, imaginative, magical, and fun. She enjoyed creating art on paper, making little cardboard mansions, creating scrapbooks for all her animals, including their birth certificates, going on magical rainy day adventures with an umbrella, a jacket, and some pixie dust, and dreaming up a way to buy land and horses of her own to ride. Pierre recently started Creative Indeed as a way to merge her original intuitive artwork her love of creative writing, and meaningful positive events for the community. Well, the name is new. Uh, I'm formerly known as Inspired Living, which I've hosted the, the last couple events through that name. And my artwork was done through Aura Art Creation, so now I've merged it all to one cohesive business name, Creative Indeed. Michelle has always kept an open mind and has tried to take the things she loved and turn it into a business venture. I can take what I love and not just be making money from it, but to be helping uh, the community at the same time. Anytime she feels something is beneficial for her, Michelle is more than willing to share it with others and encourage them to follow whatever their passions may be. And speaking of passions, Michelle has a deep passion for anything art. Putting images together, it's hard to articulate it because it's all kind of abstract images in my mind that just, you know, seem to magically come together, but basically, maybe that's what it is. It's taking the images that I have in my mind and turning them into positive physical things, whether it be an event or a workshop or a piece of art or a blog post or whatever. But there's always the focus of uh, bringing out positive solutions that can help other people at the same time. She explains that the background focus of everything she does is that it helps someone at the same time. In fact, she offers creative writing workshops. The most recent workshop had a small turnout, but that was exactly what she wanted. We had a small crowd, which was exactly what I wanted. I just wanted a couple people to come and, um, and experience the creative intensive workshop. And it wasn't only writing, we also did like collage making and stuff. And it was, we had a good time. I think everyone got something out of it and we all, I'm involved in the process at the same time with the attendees, so I'm doing the same activities that they're doing. Michelle plans to hold another workshop and is excited, and down the line she hopes to offer it to businesses as well. This creative mother of two also has a fondness for painting. She remembers drawing when she was a little girl and she had taken art in school and private classes when she could. After, um, after my second son was born, I got back. I had taken kind of a hiatus from any drawing and painting for a long time. And when I got back into it, I was actually really nervous because I didn't, uh, I haven't created anything for a long time. And I knew, I, I just had this feeling that whatever I was gonna create was gonna be ugly. But that wasn't the case. She was playing around with the paint and colors and discovered a new painting style that she'd never tried before. She realized that by allowing the process to evolve, something beautiful was the end result. The Luna Festival is another event she created. It's basically a music arts and crafts fair with, um, with a lot of kind of magic and imagination thrown into it. So you could take like a little bit of flavor from like Renaissance Fair, if you've ever heard of that, and your typical like Guam crafts fair with interactive entertainment kind of throughout. And that became the Luna Festival. It was just, it was an inspiration I had in my mind that I thought of as an event I would like to go to. The third annual Luna Festival is set for October and will be held at Jeff Pirates Cove. She invites any sponsors, performers, or vendors interested in participating to get a hold of her via Creative Indeed's Facebook page or email, inspiredshell at gmail.com. Creative Indeed is founded upon some basic principles and beliefs about positive energy and the expansion of the universe. Take what feels good and leave the rest. If you're looking for a quick pick-me-up, I suggest heading over to Michelle's blog post, myeverydaymagic.com. It will definitely do the trick.